Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Selenix Crypto. Hope you're all doing great and welcome to your daily dogs update. Uh, and a bit of a crash update as well, uh, because we had the crash. We had the bearish breakout um, yesterday evening in general. I mean, it, it was it, it was kind of multiple things, right? So, so first of all, the market just also had a bit of a dump, uh, which certainly doesn't help. All right. Even though dogs is relatively uncorrelated to the markets. Uh, what we saw is that uh, there was some correlation then, right? So the entire market fell, and that was very much uh, the final straw for dogs, which broke down below its main support level, right here at 1200. Uh, I told you in my video I, I would not buy there, and the and the main reason for that, and that's the fundamentals we need to talk about. Um, and we talked about that yesterday as well. Is is that yesterday? Um, no, two days ago, we got the updates on Telegram from the dogs community. Um, or from from the admins uh, that um, that that they would actually roll out some some new claim functions. So what I said is that you know it, it depends on if it works, and I, I still don't know, right? Because if you if you look at the the X page, if you look at the Telegram, for me personally, I think the communication by by the dogs meme coin is very very bad, right? There's essentially no communication. Like there's no, there's been no additional communication since yesterday even though I still do think that a lot of people haven't been able to claim their tokens. And that is the, 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 the true value of a project like this, all right? You need to be able to actually get your tokens to be part of the community and to actually hold some, some, some trust and, and some faith in the project. Um, it does seem to me that at least some of the claim features have worked. I still believe not everyone has their tokens yet. Let me know down in the comments if, if you do. Um, but what we already saw over the course of yesterday is is uh, a sell-off, right? So at this point of time, DOX is bearish. Um, the market is not particularly strong. Bitcoin did find some support earlier this morning, but but that was it. Um, the market is not strong. DOX had a massive bearish breakout that level around 1200 or 0 0.12 cents was a, was a massive support and us haven't broken down below that is very bearish. Um, but fortunately, if you watch my videos, you would have been at least prepared for this partially. So. What did I say when we would break down below 1200? It's that I would aim for 0 0.1 cents or a thousand or 0 0.001, all right? So in my opinion, that's what we're going for right now. You can also see that over the course of yesterday uh, towards the end of the afternoon and the evening or the night, excuse me, we also had a drop in momentum. Uh, there's a lot of short positions being opened here. So for now, what I'm waiting for is a solid support to actually buy from. I will not short dogs. And the main reason for that is that I know the market maker. All right, the market maker behind dogs is, is DWF Labs. And they are, um, well, notorious for at least orchestrating a pump in their coins at some point of time. Um, so I expect that to happen with dogs as well. But now the, 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 the key is actually being able to time that. Um, so I still think a lot of people are, are, are claiming this. I know quite a few people are, are selling their, their airdrops. So for me, it's most likely, you know, we might actually spi spike up towards 1200 again to test that. And I will be ready to buy if we're actually able to break above that. But I don't see any reason why we would break above that. I think it's most likely that, sure, we'll retest that. But that afterwards, we will continue this downtrend and this drop into that level around uh, 0.1 cents and uh, and uh, 950 down here for me that's the main support level if we get a decent bounce if we get a decent reaction from that i might buy from there but i'll keep you updated on that and uh, and and it's kind of the same as what i said yesterday about 1200 as long as there's no real certainty about the claims etc i will not blind buy from this level so i will not put a limit order but purely psychologically and technically um it should be a strong support so um, I'll keep you updated on that. Also make sure to join my Telegram or Discord if you have any questions regarding anything I said, because I'll be able to answer that in, in there. Um, and, I'm, uh, and, and the YouTube comments work a little bit less for that, in my opinion. Um, but yeah, so, so check me out there. But for now, I think that's what you need to know. Like I said, if for some reason we are able to break above 1200, then I think that's interesting as well. But I'll, again, I'll keep you updated on other socials on that and in my uh, middle of the day market updates, probably. So keep an eye out, uh, keep, keep an eye out uh, for, for that. But for now, thank you for watching. Uh, have a great day, of course, and bye.